Good morning, super cool party people, and welcome back to the theater. I have already had a rough start to the day, mostly. So I came in and there were a ton of people around our um, stage door, which is like our staff entrance. And so I got past them, and when I hit the first button on the alarm code, it made like a weird noise, a uh, noise I've never heard before, and I put my password in and it did not work. And then I tried again and I was like, and I tried to reset it and it didn't work. And um, then finally I just set off the alarm. And so then I called the company to be like, hey, FYI, this is who I am. I have set off an alarm here. And they were like, where is that? Um, can you give me an address? And so I like gave him an address. He's like, we don't have anything at that address. And I'm like, but like your number is right here. And so I like double checked the address. I'm like, yeah, no, this is the address and this is what it's called. And he's like, do you have the password? And nobody has the password to set off the alarm. Nobody knows what it is. I thought it was my title, which I gave him when I called. And so then I tried getting a hold of my boss. Couldn't get a hold of him. I tried texting him. <laughs> and finally, after like seven minutes of this alarm going, meh, 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 which is so annoying, um, my boss called me and said, OK, you can put your password in now, and it should be OK. And so <sighs> I did that. But yeah, I'm very stressed right now. But like, the biggest thing was like, why don't you know that? Where, why don't you have this address? Because this is the address. So anyways, I'm here now. I'm going to be calming down from this for a couple minutes and then I'm gonna get to work. Well, hello, I am back home and back in my pajamas because I am just completely gassed. Can you turn off, please, sir? There we go, I'm like, I'm exhausted. So, and I've already had to take allergy medicine and I'm about to take some more because breathing, it's a thing that I enjoy doing. Anyways, I got some mail. It's more um, elastic. You can't really see because it's like dark on dark, but it's more elastic for masks like this stuff here, the really thin stuff. And the reason I got it is because, <laughs> because I have problems. Um, these stoppers here, I ordered a pack, I think it's of 200 and 100 are white and 100 are black. And I'm like, it will annoy me if they don't match. So, and it'll be nice too, because there's some fabrics here that I think would look better with the black this fabric situation is out of control. So basically, once I finish sleeping, <laughs> which is what I'm gonna do now, um, my hope, oh my God, I'm so tired. My hope is to get pictures of all of these so I can send pictures to people who want masks and I can provide. And then I wanna finish this dude today if I can. I just have the beak and then this side of the face to do, so. That shouldn't take too long. No, that'll take a couple hours probably. Um, and then there's a pre-order on an online store for fabric that I want to peruse. And then I need to send an email to my grandmama. At some point I should edit some vlogs, but it's not looking promising. And then, yeah, just a little random things to do. Cut some masks to send to someone to check for sizes and all that. Anyways, I'm gonna go to sleep and I'll see you after my nap. Well, hello, I have been revived. It's um, eight o'clock, basically. I slept from 3.30ish to like 5.30. Uh, obviously, I needed the sleep and I probably could have gone back to sleep. Um, not feeling the greatest. I think it's the smoke and everything. My throat really hurts and I'm just like not, I did not eat much at dinner and my tummy hurts and then I was lightheaded and so it's great, but I'm about to take pictures of all my fabric. Um, I think I'm gonna try to group them by themes, like all my nautical stuff and then all my marine stuff or something like that. I don't know. And then send an email, shop the pre-order, etc. I'm not gonna get as much done as I want to get done today, but that is okay. I look really pale. Is it just the lighting? <laughs> I put the orange light on and pretend it's okay. Anyways, so that's what I'm about to do. Uh, hopefully it'll go quickly. And then I'm just making plans with my breakfast buddy to meet up tomorrow for, I think, lunch or maybe a coffee. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Um, which is, like, great because I want to see her. But also I'm, like, uh, going outside. Uh, so we'll see. Anyways, I'm going to shut up and I'm going to start taking pictures of the millions of meters of fabric I have. 
Good morning, super cool party people. Welcome back to the theater. Um, I am exhausted this morning. I had like a nap yesterday, which was very much needed. I think it was like an hour and a bit. And then I didn't get to sleep till like one-ish and I definitely could have slept a lot better. I am just, I am so tired. And because of the stupid seat covers, like normally I, would be off on Friday, but I think I have to come in and sew a bunch of seat covers. So that's really exciting. Um, the smoke is a little bit better than yesterday morning, but not as good as it was yesterday afternoon. And actually, if you look into the house, because it's the biggest room of the theater, you can see that there's smoke lingering near the top, which is awesome. Man, I'm tired, but today, after work, I'm only gonna work until noon, I'm going for lunch with my breakfast buddy, so that's super exciting. Uh, she's going back into Blind Channel today for who knows how long, um, so it'll be nice to see her. My one, they apparently like wanted to do a, like camping in Tofino this weekend, <laughs> but I was like, I have previously, previous, previous, not previously, I have previous plans, like on the 19th, like I can't go. And then also with the smoke, I wouldn't be able to go anyways because I'm, I would die. Um, and then Bubs messaged me yesterday. She's like, oh, hey, do you want to do something on Saturday? And I was like, oh, yeah, sure. And then a couple hours later, I was like, wait, Saturday's the 19th. That's, that's the day that I have plans for. So anyways, hopefully I get to see her before she goes because she is moving to Ontario for a couple months at least. So yeah, anyways. I'm gonna go have my breakfast drink and try to stay awake and then get all my stuff done. I don't think I have too much of, of my tasks to do today because I did a lot of them yesterday. Um, so I should be able to sew some seat covers at some point today. I also feel like I had something else that I wanna talk about, but it's, it's escaped me for now. It's fine. Well, hello, I am home now. I put on makeup because I felt like it. I'm like, I have a lot of makeup sitting there that is not being used. Anyways, I'm gonna turn this off because that is loud and I'm going to melt because it is hot. So, I got off work at about 12.30, I think it was. Um, I ended up going up and sewing for a bit. Didn't get a ton done, but I had lunch plans. So then my friend picked me up and we went for lunch and it was weird because this is the first time I have gone out and eaten since March or before March because I don't know so yeah but it was so nice to catch up with her even though I only saw her like 12 days ago but it was just nice because you know you spend two months together and then it's like bye <laughs> um but yeah it was good so we chatted and we hung out and it was good and then she dropped me off back at home and then she's gonna go to the store I think to get a couple things before she headed back out to Blind Channel for the foreseeable future who knows anyways I have been working on organizing my fabric here. So in the top of this bin, I have all my Halloween stuff because I'm gonna make some Halloween scrunchies and then everything else is just kind of nicely put away, except for that I need to fold that and I need to fold that, but that's like three meters and that's two meters and it's a pain to fold. And then here I have a couple different orders for masks. So one, two, I think I'm gonna do these two for me to start um, and then another one and then another one so we're working well we're not really working but like we can pretend we're working and um then yesterday i cut these masks um one of every size because i need to send them to somebody to see what size fits her family um so that is cool and then last night i do need to iron this but last night i finished my tote bag Look at it. It's so cool. I'm pretty happy with that. So I'm going to iron that at some point and then I'm also going to iron all my... Can I pull one out without destroying the... No. Maybe this one? Iron all my scrunchy noodles to make them fettuccine noodles, I guess. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's on the books for today. For a second I thought I sewed both sides. Um, down, which is not what I'm supposed to do, but I didn't. Anyway, so that's on the books for today. I also want to put away my laundry, which I washed days ago and have still not bothered to deal with. <laughs> I've just, I've partitioned off my hamper to one side is the dirty clothes and one side is the clean clothes. And that's not cool, but 
I think I'm just gonna, I don't know, I think I'm gonna iron. I think that's the current plan. So that's what we're doing. And then we'll see where we get to from there. Well, hello again. It has been quite some time. Wow, it is 22.11. I'm really not sure how that happened, but I ironed a bunch of scrunchies and I started to get like, just wasn't feeling the greatest. I was very warm because it was hot in the room, but I was also very chilly. Uh, like I was sweating and like freezing and I was like, this is not good. And so I was like, obviously the first thought is like COVID. <laughs> and then I was like, well, the smoke has obviously really been affecting me. So it could be that, or it could just be like, my body is like, you are too hot, you need to cool down. So I just kind of stopped and chilled for a bit after that, and then eventually I had dinner, and I do feel quite a bit better, but I am pretty tired, so it could also be my body just going, oh, you're tired. So I just got out of the shower, and I think I'm gonna climb in to bed here very shortly. Um, I thought I had to do invoicing tonight, but it's Wednesday, and I do invoicing Thursday. So that was a very exciting thing for me. And, um, yeah, I've just been watching, oh, what, what's that? Bondi Rescue. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's what I've been up to. I think I need to do a better job of drinking water because lately I have not been doing a great job. In the summer, it was so good. I was having, like, three of these a day at least. So, yeah. Anyways, hopefully we'll get back on track with that because I think that's part of it. And then also just getting some better sleep. I'm working tomorrow and then probably Friday and then I can sleep on Saturday, I think. So yeah, anyways, I'm going to go end this vlog here. Maybe pick up the next one tomorrow. Who knows? <laughs> Good night.